There's one technique that all professional photographers use that helped me take my photos from me to yeah. That one technique is shaping lighting. What do you mean a light like this? No, 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 not that lighting. We're talking about post-production lighting. Like using masks to highlight your subject or a key point of interest. Phew, I get worried. I thought I'd have to spend a couple G's. Don't worry, this technique is not gonna cost you any extra money. As an example, let's look at one of my favorite photographers, Aaron Brimhall. So in this shot, he would have used a linear gradient mask from the bottom of the scene to kind of darken that scene by lowering the exposure. Then he would have used a radial gradient mask from the right side of the frame, bringing into the left to kind of bring a bit of like that sun flare, kind of balloon and then he would have probably used a radial gradient mask over his subject to kind of pop his subject with a little bit more clarity probably raising the exposure to bring a little bit more emphasis to his subject you see, the main reason why this technique is so effective is because the eye is more attracted to the lighter spots of an image and less attracted to the darker spots of the image. The easier you can make it for a viewer to know exactly where they should be looking in your image will determine the impact that your photos have. 